right now in front of a restaurant looks like it's called Ricardo Trattoria because I'm in Chicago and one of my online watchers named Farsinji went ahead and recommended this place to Chicago. I asked you guys what place in Chicago would you go to and he recommended this place. So we are now here in front of this place. It looks really busy. Reservations are not easy to get. So we're going to go ahead, go inside and try it out and see what it's like. So like most Italian restaurants, you're going to have some bread that came out. There's a very wide variety mix of bread. I've already been eating some of it. You can see it's mostly uh, Italian bread you're used to. And you can see we got some olive oil they add for the dip. It has a little bit of herby taste to it. And the olive oil makes a nice dip for us. It's some good bread to start off with your meal. And now we're going to wait for the meal to come out. So I got a bacon wrapped pork with risotto. So let's take a look and see what this one tastes like. One thing I noticed about the side of the dishes, they're not extremely large, so it's nice. You know, do not fill yourself up too much. And there's a pork loin, bacon wrapped pork loin and risotto. You see a lot of sauce on the side. Pork loin is well cooked. Uh, the bacon wrap has a very nice texture, nice flavor to it. Let's go with the risotto. The risotto is very creamy. It's a nice risotto. So it's you know, a very good flavor of risotto. This is a pretty good meal in itself. Let's go ahead and see what the next one is like. This is uh, standard pasta carbonara. If you don't know, it's like egg noodles with um, bacon inside and tea pepper on the top. And a cheese sauce. Try a little bit of it. Because that has a very good flavor to it. Um, I really like the noodles are, you know, they're not too tender. They're a little, a little firm, which is good. Uh, the pepper on top was a nice flavor, and the, the bacon inside makes it a very good pasta dish. Next thing on appetizer, you can see it's shrimp and calamari, breaded, and with a sauce. Let's see what it tastes like. Good tender calamari. The sauce is kind of like a spaghetti sauce with the cheese in there, and it tastes pretty good. I definitely eat that. Uh, so now I have a rigatoni with some Italian sauce. You can see some cheese on the top. Something my daughter really likes with that cheese. Take a bit of the sausage. Boston cheese, a bit of everything. And peas as well. That cheese definitely has a very good flavor to it. I really like the cheese topping. You know, the sausage is very, it's better than average Italian sausages, so it's a good sausage. And the noodles are really nice with the tomato based sauce on it. So this dish is definitely a very good dish to have. I would highly recommend a dish like this one. This one's really tasty. So overall, the prices are fine. The dishes taste pretty good. And they're not extremely huge like you know, in Olive Garden or those other restaurants, which is good to leave yourself some space if you're going to have dessert or if you don't want to fill yourself up too much. So overall, this is a nice restaurant to attend. Yeah, yeah.